Hello and welcome to this short video. Today we're going to be showing the customer dynamics E2 agent for Microsoft Dynamics CRM that integrates with the Nice and Contact CX1 Contact Center platform, as well as the Ring Central Contact Center platform and the Verizon BCC Contact Center platform. On the screen, today we've got the left side of the panel with Microsoft Dynamics CRM updated cloud version in the new UI or new UCI that rolled out in 2021. The new interface focuses around call navigation or navigation within the same screen, really keeps everything in front of the agent. On the right side of the screen, we've got the E2 agent that we'll be talking about today. So the E2 agent is designed to sit within the same dynamics CRM window your agents will currently work in giving them a single pane of glass for all of their actions in the day instead of needing to toggle between a phone application for handling calls and their CRM application. The E2 agent as well is designed to increase agent productivity significantly with a lot of features such as screen pops, automatic phone activity creation. It's also designed to reduce handle time, designed to increase customer service. People know who they're talking to when they call in. We'll get into a lot of the features around screen pop, click to dial, activity creation, navigation history, pending navigation, and what those things mean in the next video around screen pop. For this video, I wanna highlight the agent over here. So we're actually on an active call. Call was delivered and it did do a search and screen pop to the current account up. The right side of the screen, we get a pre pop or activity tile that shows the account we're currently on. This account shows the entity type, shows the name of that entity. The phone number is displayed two places the call came in on. And this is the existing nice and contact skill that the call came in on as well giving the agents a lot of information up front that they'll be able to handle and use throughout the call. The screen pop, again, happens to the left and controls the navigation on the screen in dynamic CRM. The phone controls here on the right side of the screen give you all the ability to control the call in this single pane of glass without needing another agent application up. So agents are able to schedule commitments, uh, which are essentially callbacks on this platform. Um, scheduled callbacks for their own themselves or a skill that they're in. They can place the call on hold. They can mute their side of the phone, unmute it. They have the ability to mask. Masking a recording is going to put white noise into the recording on a recorded call. They can unmask it once they're done collecting sensitive information. And they have the ability to manually start a recording of a call if needed. The last action here is the ability to disconnect or hang up the call when the conversation is done. This agent installs onto any of the dynamic CRM apps that you wish you can control which of the new UI apps it displays on if only a portion of your group or company is using the application. It also minimizes out of the way, still functions, doesn't disconnect any of the call that it's on, it gives you the agent a little bit more real estate to work in if they need to. And then as they interact with the call, they can open it back up, see where they are at. And that's a high level overview of the E2 agent. It is ability to install very short time frame. It's in implementation time can be anywhere from about a week to two weeks um, with some a lot of functionality abilities you can build into it very easily with the configuration profile. I'll get into more of the other features and into details of those features and options um, in later videos. Thank you for joining.